All right, hi people, it's Shakes here. I'm here to do an unboxing for you guys today of Rugrats, the complete series DVD set from Nickelodeon and Paramount. So, yeah, I saw this was out and didn't get it for a while, but it was on. It went on a sale on Amazon, so for like I think less than thirty bucks. So I'm just like, hey, why not? So, yeah, um, <clears throat> it's funny because I believe this series originally got individual season sets through Amazon that were DVD R's basically made up or manufactured on demand, I believe. So yeah. Um, but Paramount decided to re-release it in an official, in an official original or complete series set. Um, so yeah. So on the front right here, you got the Nickelodeon logo, Rugrats, the complete series, all the main characters right there throughout the show. So yeah. Side here, you got Reptar, and then Rugrats, complete series and everything, DVD, closed captioned, Paramount and everything. The other side, uh, back, this is the original series, not the CGI series. I, I don't know if that's gotten a, a DVD yet, um, but it is on Paramount Plus, so yeah. So in the back, Nickelodeon, Rugrats, complete series, some artwork of the characters formatted as... Um, well, photos, but I'm trying to, Polaroids, and then, um, photo booth, photos, and a stamp, so yeah, description of the set, special features, runner Rider Reptar, all grown up, I think that that's the, uh, that's the 10th anniversary special that then spawned the all grown up show, Babies in Toyland, Tales from the Crib, Snow White, Tales from the Crib, Three Jacks, and a Beanstalk, Dolby Digital, English Stereo, Region 1, Dolby Audio, so yeah. Classic Supo, so yeah. <clears throat> no idea if that's how it's actually pronounced, but I've heard it pronounced a few different ways. So yeah, so here we go with the DVD case. And this is something I don't like that they did with this. So we have all these, but they stacked the discs. So there's at least two discs, sometimes three, per stack. This isn't good. I don't like this at all. I guess I kind of prefer how they would later do, like, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, as well as how Cards Network would later do, um, I think it was, maybe not Ed, Ed and Eddie, but maybe Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends, where the discs aren't stacked. So, yeah. Uh, so, I guess a forward from E.G. Daly, the voice of Tommy, right there. Um, for inside artwork, at least on that side. So, yeah. So, we got all the Season 2 discs. They're in reverse order, I think, of what they should be. Yeah, no, I hate... I hate stacked discs. I don't understand why companies keep doing this shit. So... And season 2 disc 1... Season 1, Discs 1 and 2. Don't understand this organization system. But yeah. And we have Season 3 Discs. And then, start of, or no, okay, I thought that would be the start of season four, but nope. Just the season three discs. But yeah, I guess the starting discs were the only ones placed out of order for no reason. Ah, oh, man, I don't 
So the start of season four, and then the season five is. So I'm just not going to take these out anymore. Is at least until the end. So season six discs, and then I guess maybe the start of season seven, and then the last of season seven and season eight. We got season nine. I wonder if they'd ever do a DVD set for All Grown Up. So I do remember liking that show. So, yeah. so then you got more pictures of the main characters from the show. Formatted again like Polaroid stamps. And uh... Uh, photo booth photos. So, yeah. Yeah, companies do not do this. This is a pain in the ass, please. Just don't do this. Alright. So that's basically it for this set. So yeah, so uh, it's a bit of a pick your poison kind of thing. If you like the uh, cases that have the uh, disc holders that aren't attached to the middle or the spine of the thing for no reason, or if you prefer it like this, where this case is really, really stupid. So. Yeah, um, either way is stupid, but I think this is stupider, but yeah. But, not, eh, not much else to say, so, yeah. Uh, link to the description all my shit, subscribe if you want, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I may get a completely different, um, disc case if I can find one that holds this amount of discs, so yeah. But yeah, see you guys in the next one.